Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I wanted to give you a quick update on the situation with my primary device, the iPhone 11 Pro Max. Now for those of you that follow me already know that iOS 13.5 pretty much break this device. And for those of you that do not know, I want to give you a quick uh, overview of what happened. So I've been using the iPhone 11 Pro Max, my primary device on iOS 13.5 beta. When updating to beta 3 for 13.5, my device was sent into a boot loop. Now if you haven't watched my video explaining the whole situation, links will be in the description down below for that video but pretty much after updating to beta 3 on 13.5 this iphone 11 pro max face id started acting a little weird and it eventually it sent the iphone into a boot loop which i couldn't exit out of recovery mode i tried dfu mode i tried every single option i even contacted apple in order to bring the software back to the home screen and so what i ended up doing was sending this device to apple and they sent it back saying that the hardware was damaged and it was not covered by the warranty. So pretty much Face ID was damaged with the software update, but it isn't covered by the warranty on this device. Now again, this device was never opened, it was never dropped, it was just updated, and this is what I get now. Face ID is not available. Now I didn't, I was kind of hesitant on filming this video because I didn't want to send the wrong message across. This might be just an isolated incident. I just maybe just had bad luck on this one. But Face ID is now broken on my primary device or what was my primary device, the iPhone 11 Pro Max. As you can see there, Face ID is not available. Try again and it continues to tell me this every time I try to set up Face ID. I try multiple attempts. It says there, move iPhone a little higher, move it a little lower, but it sends me back to this. Face ID is not available. Now again, this was after updating to iOS 13.5 beta 3. Again, a beta software. Now when iOS 13.5 is officially released to the public, and this is the whole, I guess, outcome of this video. I wanted to give you guys a quick warning. Just hold off on updating to 13.5 until everything is sorted out. Let's see what, what happens after the major update is released for everyone. If there's more devices that do get Face ID bricked after updating, then yeah, you wanna hold off. So that's why I wanted to give you a quick warning. 13.5, the outcome was Face ID uh, was broken pretty much or bricked with the software. Apple can't replace it, so now I have this device that it's in working order but it doesn't work uh with face id doesn't work on this device just kind of let you guys know a quick update uh stay tuned here to the channel for more updates on 13.5 i'll continue the coverage of course on additional devices that i do have available and i hope you guys have a great day and i'll see you real soon peace